Can we talk about you for a minute? How, sure. How are you? <laughs> how are you? How are you doing all of this? You're writing. You're starring. You're acting. You're the showrunner. You're the EP. You're doing all of these things. In the profile in our paper in the Washington Post, the the writer said you you get by on four hours of sleep. How do you do it all? Yeah, not a lot of sleep. Um, look, I think I spent a lot of years in this business being very broke and very bored and very not in demand. And so <laughs> I think it's just like, yo, when the time happens, I'm not going to waste a moment of it. And people are like, what do you do for self-care? And I'm like, I don't know, make an Emmy Award winning sketch show. I don't know. But yeah. I <laughs> I have like a big overall deal. I have a production company. We have like a dozen or more projects in development. Like there's so much more going on beyond j just making the sketch show, but the sketch show takes up my entire year. I mean, um, you know, it is a lot, but I love working with writers. I love my cast. Oh my God. I love my cast. I love being on set. I love shooting the show. I love the public being able to see it once it's out. This is my gift to black women. It's for everyone to enjoy, but it is my specific gift for black women in the black community. Um, and it's my invitation to those who are not in our community to come see what we think authentically. You know, we're, we don't represent every black person or every black woman, but, you know, we are representing an authentic tape. And I think mm -hmm. that that's what makes me so excited because I feel like so many times our comedy is watered down or it has to be explained. And HBO said, don't explain, just do you, you know? And they've been such incredible partners uh, and continue to be such incredible partners. So how do I do it? Um, I have a lot of support. I have assistants who help. I have people who care about me and who make sure that I eat um, because I won't. <laughs> and then I, I have just incredible people who take care of me and, and I try to do the same for them. And it's my joy though, to give people work. It's my joy that hundreds of people get to pass through this show in some way or another every season and and earn money from it, but also earn a credit from it that they leave here better when they came. I tell my staff, my crew, my writers, my rack, my actors, I say, you were likely underestimated wherever you were before this, and that stops now. And I think that's how I want them to treat me. I want them to hold me accountable to do my best work. And and look, I'm a very demanding boss. There's no secret about that. Um, but I think the proof is in the pudding and what we're creating. And it was no small feat to be able to do something that no one else in history had done before. Mm -hmm. And so I don't take that lightly. And I know that mm -hmm. if it wasn't me, it could have been a, one of a dozen other black women who are equally or more talented than I am. So I just don't take it lightly. Mm -hmm. So how do I do it? I wake up every day and realize the privilege that I have to be in this position. And I just try not to waste it. 